What's up, everybody? Uh, this is a momentous day. Um, you know, I'm always doing taste tests, you know. One of my favorite places to go, Costco. Um, you know, I've done it all at Costco food court, you know. The forbidden the forbidden hot dog where, you, you know, you get the Costco hot dog, you put it in a chicken bake. Yeah, I've done that. Um, you know, I've taken all kinds of risks for the sake of video technology. But today, this is next level because I'm here. By the way, th shout out Max behind the camera, fellow internet soldier, SNK elite. Max is uh, behind the camera just to help me. We're here. You might want to show this over here. Yeah, we're at the food court. We are at the Costco food court in Japan. Actually, what area would you say this is? Uh, it's Kawasaki in Kawasaki. Kanagawa. Yeah. Near Yokohama, basically. Near Yokohama. Okay. So, but we are at Costco in Japan. They have a different menu. We're gonna try it all. We're gonna we're gonna sample everything. We got the classic hot dog. You have to get the hot dog. Oh yeah, for sure. Now it's I classic. noticed. Now I noticed though. I will say, the classic dollar fifty hot dog. When I was last here at a Costco, it was one hundred and fifty yen. I'm noticing it's one hundred and eighty yen now. So, you know, they may uh, they may never raise it in America, but I'm I, I'm just saying, the house of cards may start to fall. I don't know, but we're gonna try. We're gonna see if it's better here or not. Then instead, they don't, we're not doing chicken bake. We're not doing chicken bake. We're doing bulgogi bake. They got a bulgogi bake. Damn, that's already smelling good. It's my favorite thing here on the menu. Is sure. it? Yeah. Oh my gosh. I get one every time I come to Costco. For sure. Dude, that's amazing. Okay, and then we got, this is like a sweet potato yeah. soft serve. Yep. Next level. Got a swirl there. And then this is like a grape smoothie. Yeah. Is that what Japanese it is? Japanese grape smoothie, yep. Japanese grape smoothie. Okay, well, you know what? Oh, and by the way, you get you do get the soda with the hot dog, just like America. They got Mountain Dew here. Is that the most crisp yellow Mountain Dew you've ever seen? I mean, it's just like, damn, it's like, well, let me see if this is good. A little taste test. Oh. That's like straight from the mountain itself. All right. I'm hungry. I got to dig in. All right, let's just, let's just start with the hot dog. We got, we got to know. Yeah. We got to know. I didn't do any, I didn't do any fix it, you know, I didn't fix it up. No ketchup, no mustard. I just want to know, does the hot dog itself taste better? We, we, we got to find out. Let's find out. Did you say? Did you say that this is a different type of hot dog? Is it's pork? I think. Is that it, what it is? I think because it doesn't say 100 percent beef. 100 percent pork hot dog. Yeah, there we go. That's what it is. Yeah, there it is. So, um, yeah, it definitely. It's not. Um, sorry, I, I was kind of. By the way, I'm kind of been losing my voice. I've talked so much on this damn trip. After this, I'm going silent, monk style. Um, <laughs> it's not better or worse. It's like it's. It kind of reminds me of like the breakfast sausage you have out here. You know what I mean? Like, okay, yeah. you have like a breakfast out here, sausages like this. Uh, yeah. It tastes like that. I feel like most sausages and hot dogs, not always, but they have a similar taste in Japan, mm. I feel like. So maybe that's part of it, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, it's, it's really, yeah, yeah right? it's not better or worse. It's just that. You it's know? different. It's really different, yeah. I dig it though. That's pretty good. Okay. And I gotta wet, I gotta wet the pipes. We're gonna wet the pipes Gotta right wet now. Wet that whistle, dude. Grape smoothie. Let's see if it's all that. All right. Oh, should be like real fruit and all that stuff. It should be pretty damn good. Okay, that's good. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's like. It's funny. It like. It has a little bit of that grape soda taste. Like like. Yeah. That artificial grape, but then. You're tasting the real stuff in there too. It's like they found the perfect intersection of what you expect a great drink to taste like versus what it should taste like, yeah. if that makes sense. I like it, I like it. I'm digging that, I'm having another sip of that. Yeah, it's a specific type of uh, grape in Japan. It's called kyoho, and um, okay. they're, I don't know if you could call them. Here, here, let me, let me, let me, let me yeah, get sure, you sure, on sure. camera. Yeah, yeah. yeah, what are you saying? But yeah, so the, it's a specific type of grape that they're like purple grapes like we have back in the States. Sure, so yeah, yeah. The, the flavor's really good. They're really juicy. I don't know. They feel like kind of like a premium grape. Yeah. So when you see that on something, I always make sure to get it because yeah. it's really good. 
Yeah. So it's nice to hear that it's, it's got that flavor at least. Yeah, it, so. yeah, yeah. That's legit. That's really that's really good. Okay, well, that's a winner. So far, all winners. I'm, I'm thinking that, but this this is what I came here for. Ooh, I love the chicken bacon home. How is it? Okay, okay. It looks, it's looking fairly similar. Same bread, probably. Probably yeah. same uh, outer layer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A little look at that. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. You're getting some of that baked in cheese situation. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Chicken bake, a lot to live up to. A lot to live up to. Okay, let's see what this is all about. This is, this is what I've been waiting yep. for. We'll go you bake. Sounds so good. Let's, probably let's see if it's as hot. good. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, you probably, probably got it. <laughs> all right, let's see. God help me. It is hot. That was a lot of bread. I'm gonna need one more bite. Mm. Oh. What the hell is in here? There's a lot going on. Take a mm. little look at the cross section. Mm. Oh. Oh. Like, okay, I'll say this. The, ch the chicken bake at Costco is definitely like its own thing you can only get at Costco. This is like you went and got Korean barbecue and took the whole night that you had Korean barbecue, just wrapped it up into a bread thing and ate it. It's got its own, it's, its own experience. Oh. got the cheese oh, I didn't know I didn't know it was gonna have cheese oh. that's a 10 that's a 10 okay so far slam dunk every level I can't believe that this is amazing I mean how could that you're seeing that how could that go wrong Meat what could cheese? go wrong yeah, here great. dude the meat is like, yeah, like I said, it's like, it's like Korean barbecue in a pocket, you know? I'm in awe of that. That's, they, they nailed it. They nailed it. Okay. Got dessert. We're going to try there this. There we go. This is what's weird. I've never had like sweet potato yep. soft serve. It's a swirl with vanilla, right? With Hokkaido milk? Yeah. Okay. Hokkaido you know, soft if it's Hokkaido milk, you know it's going to be good. Oh, yeah. We're going to try the sweet potato part. Let's see. All right. Nothing's gone wrong since, so like the odds might be against this. We'll find out. Yeah. What the? That doesn't even taste like sweet, but I don't even know what that tastes like. Specific, it's like a purple yam or something. So I mean, like the purple yeah. variation yeah. of it. Yeah, so. It just tastes, I don't know how to describe it. It just tastes like heavenly. That might be my favorite thing of all of them. It's so good. This is like, that's like the best soft serve I've ever had. <laughs> Am I losing my mind? I'm not overhyping this. I'm not trying. Oh, it's to. amazing. I get it. Yeah. Really? You get Regular, this often? Regularly, yeah. Oh. They have a couple, I don't remember all the flavors though, but I always try to try a new one when they, yeah. when they swap it out. It's like once a month, I think they do a new flavor. Oh, okay. So it won't be sweet potato like next month. Yeah, I'd say it's oh. one or two months or something. I always just check and, and see what it is. And yeah. They might, like, swap in some of the flavors, you know what I mean? Maybe, like, oh. once a year they do, you know, X flavor a couple this times This is, like, or a fall right? thing, you're saying? Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Oh. This thing, the, uh, they call it, like, Murasaki Imo. It's, like, Dude. purple yam. It's, yeah, very uh, full is, season flavor. I, I'm, I'm stunned. I thought this was going to be, like, ooh, weird. It's just amazing. It's, it, I really don't know how to describe it. It's just like the sweetest, best soft serve ever. Mm, mm. It tastes like um, like Willy Wonka's factory. I don't know how to describe it. That's really, I don't know how else to describe it. If you could just run your tongue all the way through his factory. Oh my God, and the bulgogi bake. Oh. 
Mm. This might be the best meal in Japan right here. You ready to hear first? Skip, skip all the cafes, get a Costco membership, get down here, and then check this out. This is just free. Yeah. Cleaning alcohol. If you need a little spritz on your hot dog, yeah. you know, it's just there just in case. Sometimes you, know? you get a, you know, a hot dog that just looks like, ah, oh, a little dirty. A little dry, you know. That's why I didn't use ketchup, I didn't use mustard, I just cleaned that thing up. Yeah. That's kind of amazing. Wow. It's the true experience, you know, coming to Costco, oh. mm. get a little spray on your dog. All right, well, thank you, everybody. I, I can't believe, I can't believe. This This was the mind blower. This was all good, but, you know, I expected it to be pretty good. I didn't think this was going to be crappy or anything. This was next level. This is like, I'm in awe of that. Anyway, all right, everybody. I'm going to go look around. I'm going to get some bulk mayonnaise. I'm going to get some toilet paper. Because I haven't been to the U.S., uh, you know, since everything's been going crazy over there, maybe they're running out of toilet paper. Again. Did that happen here during the pandemic? Yeah, for sure. It happened here it was too. So I had to find just like little hole in the wall, like convenience stores or um, like pharmacies, just to find places that had it, or like look online on Twitter just really? to, to find toilet paper. I really thought tough. that was just a U.S. exclusive debacle. Yeah, no, that's so crazy. Oh well, yeah, for sure, for sure. I may be stocking up. I may have to um, check a few bags. TP. I'm gonna get on that. But I got like five things to eat first, so uh, I'm gonna a I'm gonna ask for my privacy now. Yeah, Thank man. you, everybody. Thanks for tuning in. I'll take I'll take that. I'll take that. Got to end it. Got to end it. Cool.